Here's an application of an ellipse. You've got a planet with a satellite going around it in an elliptical orbit. And one of the biggest issues with this problem is that you really need to draw the picture well. So let's go ahead and do that. If you look at all the numbers, actually the planet's quite large. And we're told that the satellite is 1,000 kilometers above at the closest point, right, right here, and 16 kilometers above the planet at the, the farthest right there. And so we have a planet that's actually almost filling up the ellipse, which is a little strange, but it's important to have this picture in mind because when we put our axes in, which we're going to want to do because we're going to probably want the equation over the ellipse, and for that we need an x and y axis. When we put the axis in, the origin is not in the center of the planet, because remember, the planet is one of the foci of the ellipse. So that little dot there, that's actually the center of the planet. Therefore, that's the radius there from the center out, and that's also 8,000 kilometers. So the total is 18,600 kilometers if you add up the whole length here. Now, if you know that, then you also know this point right here you know it's 9300. And once you know that and the fact that this is 8000 and this is 1000, you know this point right here is 300 zero. Now there's the other focus. So of course that's at negative 300 zero. And now we can actually start answering the questions. So one question, how far apart are the foci for this ellipse? Well, it's in that area. If you look there, that's 600 kilometers apart. The next question, what's the altitude above the surface when the satellite is at one of the vertices of the minor axis? We're talking about the satellite being right here. And if you remember the equation of the ellipse, that's actually about B. We know that A, how long or half of the major axis is 9300. We know that C, where the focus is, is 300. We also know the relationship between A, B, and C. And that allows us to figure out what B is. B is about 92.95. So that point right up there, 92.95. And the radius of the planet is 8,000. So the distance that we're looking for is actually 12.95. So the satellite is 12.95 kilometers above the planet when it's at one of the vertices of the minor axis of the ellipse. And we've answered the question. Notice we didn't even get the equation of the ellipse. That wasn't asked, but we easily could because we know A, and we know B, and given that, we know the equation of the ellipse.